I spend the beginning of the year in the winter in California for a training as a professional cyclist. I've been a professional road cyclist for the past eight years and I love riding my bicycle. I also love riding my motorcycle. My name is Lex Albrecht and I'm from Montreal, Canada. I've had the chance to stand on podiums in Europe, in North America. I've represented Canada at four world championships and I've been champion of Quebec eight times. So I love riding anything that has two wheels. I love riding road bikes, I love riding mountain bikes, and I absolutely love riding my motorcycle too. One thing that I find is that any roads that are really awesome for road cycling are really awesome for motorcycling and vice versa. So sometimes when I'm on my motorcycle, what I do is I'll scope out new routes to use for training rides on my bicycle. So when I was 18 years old, I moved to a small city in the province of Quebec called Trois-Rivières. It's right in between Montreal and Quebec City and I moved there and I didn't know anybody at all and I could barely speak the language. But I had my road bike with me and every Tuesday night there were these group rides. And even though I couldn't speak with words very well to the other people who I was riding with every single week, for me it really felt like a way to feel connected with other people and I wasn't lonely and I wasn't isolated anymore and it was something that was like really special and powerful for me. So. Yeah, cycling has opened a lot of doors in a lot of different ways in my life. I ride with the Senna R1 road cycling helmet. I can listen to music and I absolutely love hip hop. When I first discovered this, I was totally blown away. One thing that's really cool is that it has the same types of controls that I have on my motorcycling helmet. So there are these three buttons here. It also, this is like the really, really cool part, permits me to have conversations with other people who I'm riding with. I've been using Senna for, for quite a few years now. It definitely enhances the ride. I just have this feeling that, okay, you know what? Someday when I'm not able to ride my bicycle anymore, I'm definitely gonna have a motorcycle, you know? If my legs can't do the work, then the motor's gonna do the work. But little did I know I would hop on a motorcycle a little bit before that point in my life. Regardless of what I do, I think I'm always going to be on two wheels, so I'll always have a bicycle, and I think I'm always gonna love riding my motorcycle. The hardest part of being a professional athlete has been being away. The lesson that it taught me in terms of the importance of connecting with people is definitely something that's gonna change the rest of my life forever. And I'm really grateful for it.